Good morning, good morning, good morning. Let's do my little saggies. Let's do my saggies. What are my little my little Sagittarians up to? My little uh, teapots. Oh, teapots. That's cute. You know what I'm going to call you guys is uh, Mr. and Mrs. Potts. All right. The cute little Mrs. Potts from uh, Beauty and the Beast. I just came up with a new word for my Saggies, Mr. and Mrs. Potts. I know some of you right now are thinking of Angelina Jolie and Brad Pitts because that just went through my head. And I legitimately said Pitts. <laughs> Any hoozy. Okay. We're going to do, um, we're going to do Raw Love now until September 9th. Okay. See where my little, my little pots are at. My little potters. How's that? How's that, my little uh, Sag? It's, it's funny because if you when you look up in the sky, your sign, your Sagittarius, it literally looks like a teapot. That's where I got that from. If you're all wondering, look at my hair. I just threw it up. Um, <laughs> that's why I just got that from. But anyway, let let's just do your all up because I feel like all of a sudden I feel super chatty with you guys. You guys must be like motor mouths right now. Kai just shook his feathers. He just shook his little feathers. They're floating around. They're floating around. Hi, baby boy. Hi, baby boy. Is my cat behind me? Yep. I thought I just saw something. Look at her. She's like, I'm just chilling. I'm just chilling. You want to come with mama? No. Alright. So going on with my Saggies. So I'm kind of doing intuitive reads. Okay. I'm using a deck that doesn't have um much on it for images. I know because you guys are always like, I really want to see the cards. Okay. Um which is all good. What is that? I thought I saw something. Oh, it's on my computer. So kind of channeled messages, intuitive read, okay. We got the Emperor reversed, all right? So, whoa, I just caught those. With the Five of Pets and the Two of Cups reversed. All right, so somebody is definitely losing their patience when it comes to either being blocked or left out in the cold or having, I can't even read it as financial difficulties because the Two of Cups is right next to it. Whatever connection this is, okay? Um, I don't know yet if it's a lost connection, so let's just continue. But I will tell you... Um, you know, definitely losing your patience with uh, some type of connection. All right, you got the five of wands reversed. So coming out of complication. Hold on, guys. Sorry about that. All right, I'm back. My little sagies, my little teapots. Um. So kind of feeling out of your element. I just got to go through this in my head again because I was just on the phone for like 15 minutes dealing with something. So um, I was kind of gathering myself before I even looked down at the cards. You feel out of control when it comes to something. I think some of you are blocked or feel lonely or feel left out in the cold. Um, I feel like you definitely want to just try to get out of this conflict with the five of wands reversed when it comes to the soulmate or... Remember, the Two of Cups, guys, is not just a lover, okay? It's a soul connection. So, with the Six of Cups, yeah, well, that's your past, so, so. That could be a friendship, too, okay? But, I, okay, it was like the second time you did that, okay? Enough. Look at the tiny little feather that came out. It's a tiny little feather. Um... So feeling frustrated when it comes to the past, okay? Um, you have the Nine of Swords with the Ten of Cups, all right? Mentally feeling trapped, all right? Because that's where your happy was, and you're not happy, okay? You, you, you want it back, I, you know, tell me about this Ten of Cups. You definitely want it back, but you feel trapped. So I'm going to tell you right now you're not, all right? You definitely... It's in your own head, okay? It doesn't exist. I mean, it exists, but it doesn't, okay? Um, with the Knight of Wands, all right? So 
you were content with somebody who was in not in not your life, which is <laughs> crazy because you were you were definitely content with the scenario. Um, hmm. Or this is cross referencing the cross watcher's energy, which is bizarre, but it happens sometimes. Okay, so this was somebody who was in and out, in and out, and I can look at it this way and say the person that was in and out, in and out was content being that way, but now feels trapped when it comes to you because they could have possibly cut you out of the picture and now they're feeling lonely because it could have backfired on them. Okay, for some. For others, I really don't, you know, for others, you're just, you're losing your patience when it comes to this blockage, this hang up, feeling lonely, okay? Um, if you guys are together, you're contemplating whether or not to be together. Um, but with this Nine of Swords and the Ten of Cups, I mean, with the Knight of Wands, I'm going to have to read this as feeling trapped. You're dealing with somebody who is all about themselves, okay? There was some tricky shit. And... I mean, it's definitely, what is that? What did I say last week in Titan 2? Like, the, the whole cat and mouse game? I mean, look at the cat and the mouse. But the cat's not even, like, worried about the damn mouse. You know what I mean? It's just kind of, like, it wants to focus sometimes and it doesn't. My energy is, like, as soon as I bring my hands up there, it's like, get away. There was definitely some tricky shit that happened, okay? And that's why... It makes sense that you're coming out of conflict. I don't think you're together with this person, though, okay? Somebody's tired. If somebody doesn't even want to work on it, and the mouse is just chilling, too, like, it's just stagnant right now, whatever this is. Because the Knight of Wands goes, all right? But now the Knight of Wands is contemplating, so it could be you, all right? Contemplating you're happy, contemplating your past. I don't... I feel like someone's clinging on to the past right now, so that's not good. Okay, so let's get out of that energy, please. Oh, you need to wait a minute, girlfriend. All right, so we got the Three of Pence reversed with the King of Wands reversed. So not putting action into nothing, not coming together, not collaborating. You know, I feel like at one point, like, tired as shit, but still trying to figure something out. I, I think somebody's using magic, okay? Um, hold up, buttercups. So I definitely, um, I'm seeing magic, candle magic, okay? So not a bad thing, it's just, it's candle magic, okay? I mean, I hope you know what you're doing. But it also looks like it might fail, okay? So you might not know what you're doing. But wanting to come together, wanting to collaborate, wanting to figure something out, waiting, when is this going to come into fruition? Like, what's going on? Like, So as tight as you are, you're, you're very impatient at the same time. Okay, um, for whomever this is. This might be a difficult read for my little Sagis right now because I have two energies on my board. All right. And now I got the Queen of Wands and mm, she might be the one using magic. With the chariot reversed. She's deciding whether or not to take action. She's very perceptive. She knows what's going on. She's working with the white light, so don't worry about negative aspects of this. Um, it's just a matter of putting it into action. Um, somebody here is Jewish. I don't does not matter. That's just for somebody who's Jewish. I don't know what's on your mind right now. If it's a Jewish holiday, you're thinking about something. Um, is there such thing as Jewish magic? I don't know. But that came out. 
Um, so this is uh, like a court couple. We have the king and the queen of wands, okay? So this is a, a meant to be connection. This is a strong connection. I think the two of you are feeling this bond. I think somebody's caught up because somebody was in and out of somebody's life. And now they're like feeling a little bit of remorse okay but neither the the well he's not taking action she's not taking action either because the chariots are reversed all right but she's upright like she's a little more confident okay and what she is what she's doing and and he's not taking action and not that he's not confident I think you guys are just taking a break right now from each other um not like hey let's sit down have a talk let's take a break no, this I think this is over. This is more than just a break, okay? But we're not talking. We're not in conflict right now. But I, there's definitely um, there's definitely some type of magic. The two of you are very in tune. The two of you are very probably spiritual in different ways. Um, but she's not taking action. He's not taking action. Okay, so there's that. Um, you have the staff reversed, so someone's watching someone. Not in a bad way, all right, but somebody is definitely using magic. There's no question, okay? Somebody's conjuring up spells over here. <laughs> And if they're unaware of it, they're unaware of it. But it's, it's taking place. It's most definitely happening. And I think they're having help. Somebody has help doing it. Somebody knows what they're doing. Someone's a beginner with getting help, okay? Um, it's not bad magic, guys. But it's not just like, you know how I say stuff's magical? It's so weird that all this magic's coming into play this week. Um, but a lot of people do do you know, could just be full moon rituals. And to me, a full moon ritual is magical. Okay. So it's not like just like magic, like spells. It is the universe is magic. Okay. It's magical. It's, you know, it's wishes and it's magical. Okay. But here there's definitely magic, like as in like spells, you know, like someone's using candle magic and I don't know if there's such a thing as Jewish magic. I know that sounds nuts, all right, but huh? You know what's funny? The cats in these pictures look like the cats behind me. Cats, cats. Her eyes right now are green, just like this one. I like yellow, okay? But at sometimes her her eyes are, are like that green color. It's so bizarre. Can you use? Can you do magic with cats? I don't freaking know. All right. Um, anywho, probably boring some of you guys. I come up with a magic quote, but it's being, it's definitely taking place. All right. Whether somebody's laying in bed and just praying and manifesting and, you know, when you pray and you manifest in affirmations, affirmations are, can be magic, guys. That's what I'm saying. So don't get all like weirded out. Okay. But somebody's feeling the loss. Okay. Over this connection right now. And neither of you are taking action. I think the, the two of you not talking right now is the best thing, okay? But this was somebody who was in and out, in and out. To, not, to me, this is a wrap-up. Uh, you know, whether you come back together or not, right now is not the time. I will tell you that right now, okay? Um, for some, tell me about this King of Wands, King of Wands, King of Wands, the magician, okay? And it's reversed, so... <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Nothing's coming into fruition right now. Not that nobody's taking action. Tell me about the magician reversed. Um, what are we backing at? The death card. Like time's up. If you guys get back together, it's not going to be this week. Not with this one. Okay, and I think there's three people involved. Okay, I think there's outsiders. It's not strong on my board, but there's definitely, which can just be outside. There's definitely outsiders. 
someone's being watched. Could be an ex, could be a friend, it could be a creep in your freaking neighborhood. Okay, so for some, but not like you're gonna get hurt, creep. Okay, got judgment. This one doesn't want to make a judgment call. Okay, something ended and somebody wants something back. Somebody definitely got stabbed in the back. Look at these cards aren't even used for magic. Look at the pendulum, pendulum, and the broken hat. Somebody's for damn sure using magic. <sighs> And that's, I don't know what to say to you. You guys have some strong, see, moon magic too. All right. Um, let me get a different deck on cards. I don't see someone stressed out too. Um, this has to do with the past. I, I don't think you guys are together right now. It is a strong connection, though. But I, I think you're dealing with somebody who's a little arrogant and not taking action. I think one's waiting on taking action. Neither of you are taking action. One's waiting on taking action. I think one's waiting to see if the magic works. It's like a waiting game. All right? So let's see if I can get any other messages because that's that. Um, so that's you. Let's see, we have the creator reverse. So it's like, this is what I'm saying. This one particular person is just waiting for the, this mama is just waiting for the right time. She's got something up her sleeve. But I don't think it's like, I don't see bad intentions right now. But to me, it's like a, a, seeking harmony, but not having it. All right. Not wanting to. It's like she's after her own her own happy that has nothing to do with you. You know what I mean? Like, and I think he's doing the same thing. <laughs> so it's like, yeah, the connection was there, but I think the two of you are very into yourselves for whoever that's for. Okay. Um like likes being tell me about the two of cups. Likes being like seeing other people, likes likes dating, regardless of the scenario. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying. Like somebody, that's, somebody's like the two of you let go of each other, but haven't really let go of each other. Still holding on, waiting for the perfect timing. Tell me about the two of cups. What a bizarre read, guys. You have two energies on the board too. All right. Um. Seven of Cups, yeah, waiting for the right opportunity, like I said, all right? With this Two of Cups, you're just waiting. That's what I'm saying. It's, I don't think it's going to be within the, I mean, judgment's here, so it's kind of like I feel like somebody needs to make a judgment call, and then at the bottom of the deck is the Ace of Wands, so yeah, all right? Whether or not this is going to come into fruition, whether or not it can be victorious, all right? But we got the King of Swords reverse at the bottom of the deck with the Niva, with the Page reverse too so still not taking action but thinking about the options right now but with this judgment here this is like within the next two weeks deciding whether or not they're going to put something into action what's up buttercup uh, benadryl uh, no I don't, i'll fall asleep at work i have a uh, no, no i don't think he's gonna sick i don't think allergies so i don't call for my allergies yeah, so that's how he has two four allergies, so it could be both, but yeah, working in a daycare now, so yeah. Um, above the sink, there is a non drowsy allergy. Just try the allergy. Why would I take an allergy for that? Because I, I think it is. I might be wrong, but that's, I think it's allergies. Why would right? I just take something for a cold? Well, we have a cough and cold up there, too. Um, can you pick one for me? Just make the decision for you. Typical Sag right there. Hold up, Buttercups. Where is it? Sorry about that. So, let's see what else we get for messages. All right. Yeah, just mentality reverse. All right, with trust. Somebody's just waiting to take. See, wait. See, I told you she's very, very um. She's very, very in tune right now. Very, very receptive. 
of what's going on. I think the two of you are receptive to it. I think one is way more receptive than the other one. I don't, I can't tell if this is, I mean, you guys are not together. Somebody's literally just waiting to take action, which is very bizarre. What a, um, very bizarre read for you guys. Um, I just lost another little feather. But this one is like completely red. I don't, is somebody using magic with feathers? Um, cause he did his little ruffle thing quite a few times. I, I don't know what, what it is you guys are up to, but, um, the Ace of Wands being at the bottom of the deck, waiting to take action. Okay. Bless you. Let me see if I can pull different, um, different story with a different deck real quick. <clears throat> Both my cats are just kind of chilling right now. The other one's right there. Saggies, saggies. Hi, Max. Hi, Max. How are you doing? All right, you got the Wheel of Fortune reverse. You know, yeah, something, you know, something didn't go in your direction. You need to focus on something new. Oh, you're focused, all right. Someone's got some new insight. Um... <laughs> The Wheel of Fortune is reversed. It talks about change, possibilities, moving forward. You know what I mean? Something going in your direction. But it's like something didn't go in your direction. So because of that, somebody is putting their focus on something else. And I'm going to say it's, it's magic. Okay? Somebody is determined to win. But Six of Wands reversed. All right, that's a Six of Wands reversed. I, I don't think you will. I don't, I don't think um, whoever's focused on being successful when it comes to whatever this is, is with the wheel being reversed too, that's not going to happen. Not in these two weeks. That's why I can't figure out if it's a wrap up or not. Okay. Somebody that didn't, is that's bless you, sweetie. Someone who's not accepting the change is focused on making that change happen and to come into fruition. And like it, again, with I'm telling you, within, yeah, not accepting, awakening, reversed, all right, not accepting this. Um, somebody's just waiting for somebody to take action. That's what I'm saying. You, it's kind of like you're both waiting for the right time, the right, the right moment. Um, but I don't think it's going to work in this person's direction, either your person or the, either your direction or this other person's direction. I really can't tell. If this is a wrap up, I know you're not together right now, but I really can't tell if it's a wrap up or not. So let's figure out what your lessons are. It was a very strange read. Hi, Kai. Was Max a little crazy right there? Was Max a little crazy right there? Was he a little cuckoo? Yeah. Come on, on my shoulder. Um. Castle staring right into the computer too. Right at the bird, right when I said it. It's my good cast cast, huh? So let's find out what's going on with my sagis. Staying disciplined, okay? Somebody for damn sure is staying uh, disciplined, but in the wrong looking at things wrong, okay? So, you know, I'm telling you, with the wheel being reversed, there's a good chance you're going to repeat the cycle because you're looking at something going in your direction. Whatever this is, you're just waiting for the right opportunity. But I don't, I think it's a no-go, okay? Courage, finding the inner strength to face your fear with courage, okay? Like, to, to move forward to accept this change, okay? And right now you're not. And you, I, you, somebody does not want to move forward, but you need to, okay? And then success, there's no greater, no greater goal than love, okay? So you need to focus on positive aspects of things, okay? Um, versus the, the negative, following your heart, Which I think somebody was trying to do in that situation. I just don't think. I think they were just thinking about it all wrong. Like it's it's being. Somebody is going about something very wrong here. Okay. Let 
let me pull you an oracle. Seeing these moons bless you. She's like, I don't think it's allergies. Yeah, okay, mama. Okay. We got some lust too. I saw that twice. I'm, I'm telling you. There might be somebody just on the outskirts lurking and watching and lusting, and it might not even be um, Sagis. It, it could be somebody that's not, that you're not even realizing is watching you. Yeah, and it could just be social media too. Okay. Um someone could just be watching you on social media. It doesn't mean it has to be outside or anything, you know what I mean? But I don't think it's the same person. So that would make three energies that were on my board. Okay. So I'm sorry if I confused any of you. And I also said normally Sagis they just go to and that you don't need people to make your decisions, okay? But I did call that like that. So some of you are in that situation. And I, it's because of the moon being indecisive, wanting somebody to make decisions for you. Okay. So in this, you did pull courage. Let's say, okay. So it says there are a few that are chosen ones that have the confidence and courage to live forever. All right. There is such a being in, in the that's kept in the oracle, safe in the sky of the castle. It's given to you at the right time. The time is now. This is your time. The world needs you. Much is going to be asked as you move through life challenges and receive the gifts. Know that I have chosen you and everything you need to do to make the right decision. Walk with your head held high to the next step with your goal with confidence, and I will be with you every step of the way. So this mama, all right, this was the queen of wands with the chariot reverse, not taking action quite yet, but waiting for the right time to take action, okay? And they're saying now it is, okay? So whatever direction you want to go in, just keep going, move, okay? Because somebody is super intuitive and knows how to work magic. Okay, it could just be universal magic. Okay, but continue to be confident, confident in yourself in order to push through. Okay, um, and I'm pretty sure that's a wrap. I'm just going to throw a couple more cards with this deck because I just feel the need to see if I can get another message. I don't. I think this is a wrap up. You know what I mean? I don't know. I'm not positive, though. For some, it's a wrap-up. For some, something will eventually come back around. It won't be this week, though. All right, yeah, the magician upright. All right, so this is now somebody's upright. That's what I'm saying, okay? So <laughs> use the damn magic, I guess. All right, go for it. Stop manifesting stuff in your life. Ace of Wands reversed, but you're not. So you're waiting on the right moment, okay? The universe is saying it's the right moment to take action, okay? So take action. These are both two number ones back to back. It's an 11, okay? Um, which is a two brand new path. Take action to move forward, okay? You're, you're more than capable of doing it, okay? And with some, it's going to be with the past, with the Six of Cups, okay? So for some, the magic is working, all right? Um... But have the confidence, you know, I did see the Ace of Cups, and that is self-love and confidence to, to push through, all right? It's the time for those who, who are hesitating, and you got to go towards somebody, now's the time, okay? So you're going to want to rewatch this, guys, because I have quite, that's too many, quite a few different stories on my board for my Sagis this week, so, which is okay, all right? You guys the fire energy it's it's go 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 okay so don't not use it and go towards this some have to go towards it something that's brand new okay making things work balancing out the scales um i don't know if some of you are dealing with libras i don't know why i feel that some of you are dealing with libras go after a libra maybe Four swords, all right, with the eight of cups reversed, all right, so yeah, with the nine of cups, somebody, you are dealing with somebody who doesn't want to talk about their feelings right now, too, all right, coming out of this, whatever this feeling was, um, deciding whether or not to walk towards something new or, or something you already walked away from, okay? <coughs> Do you have a card of these for dogs? Mm-hmm. 
Um, so, well, do you, do you need it today? Can I just leave it right, here? Hold on. All right, let me just map this out. So, for some, you're getting over this, you know, you did walk away from this person already because it's just, it's just the way it had to be, okay? And for some, you don't want to go back. Others are going to, and others are not. So go, um, I hope I didn't confuse too many of you. That really was a difficult read for even me, okay? There was definitely um, different stories there. There's no question. I had about three or four different energies all over the board going in all different directions, okay? Are you really trying to eat my glasses, my little sweet pea? <laughs> what are you doing, Papa? I love you guys. Have a fantastic next two weeks, okay? And for those who need to take action on something, take action. It's time, okay? I love you guys. Bye.